and we shall also be given the heavy task of coming up with a report. Today, the Uganda Law Society has produced a report on electoral petitions to inform the process of good governance. The Compendium of Laws was launched by the Deputy Chief Justice. It shows the last 10 years of election petitions that have been taken through the courts of law as a way to show the public that the Law Society has been at the forefront of ensuring that we are giving advice to government and different institutions with regard to uh, good governance in this country. The implementation of the public health regulations in the campaign period and the whole election process will give rise to legal issues that may end up in the court system. They also express dissatisfaction over the selective application of the law and guidelines to prevent the spread of COVID-19. And when they summoned the Chagula to explain why he holds many rallies, we went with the photographic evidence of how crowded the seven campaigns are. And we said, we want to see him tomorrow. We have not prohibited, we have not banned campaigns. We have only regulated. And the commission is mandated to regulate the manner of the campaign process. If there is a problem in any of those stages of the electoral process, that leads to a dispute. And the people involved should prepare and raise their petition to the different courts of law for resolution of that dispute. At this stage, I cannot judge what is happening before it happens. Butela has made assurance that the judiciary is prepared for the task of dealing with the expected increment in court petitions despite the mounting financial and manpower challenges. We hope probably to be shifting chief magistrate in the process from the less busy areas to the very busy areas after the petitions have been filed. Patrick Senyondo, NTV.